Good evening to everyone watching us and welcome on board to this very special edition of Artist Showcase. In the studio with me this evening, I have a living legend. When I said living legend, I actually mean a living legend. How many of you, if I could take you back the memory lane? She know, oh, 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 that's one very beautiful song I would never forget. I will tell you why when the time comes. Good evening to you, SSP. Good evening, my son. Good evening. Good evening. Before we go on, happy 60th birthday to you. Long may you live. May God give me the grace to celebrate <laughs> you at 60. Amen. 70. Amen. 80. Amen. 90. Amen. 100. Wow, 120. <laughs> But to be honest, 60 actually looks so good on you. Mm. What's the secret? Whatever you're going into. Yes. Whatever you are going into. Yes. Don't, don't ever go into because of you want to make money. Okay. No fame. Okay. I, you know my passion for music. My passion for music is too large that if I don't play music, I'll die. Really? We will get there in a minute. You so better tell me the journey into music. When and how did it start? Wow! I will not. In as much we don't have much time. Yeah. Uh, let me quickly try. I will try to paraphrase the whole thing. Yep, I come from a Kerubon and Siravo background. Okay. My father, my mother from Kerubon and Siravo. Okay. I was born Kerubon and Siravo. And there's no way you can be a Kerubon and Siravo that without having the blood. Maybe because of the maybe maybe because of the uh praise and worship. Okay. You know, Caribbean and Siravo started praise and worship. Okay. The praise and worshiping is too much in my mother's uh, blood. And from her, I got all the inspiration. My mother, Victoria Shaka Peters, was a living head of the choir of Kerubin and Strafford. Nobody can take that credit from her. Victoria, check her out. Victoria Ashake Peters. You, you, you people call it a word. Um, then they call it child. To her credit, in a private combat or I can't. She has seven children to her credit. She started the choir Kerubin of uh, Kerubin and Seraphim choir. Which Kerubin and Seraphim? Every Kerubin and Seraphim. Let me tell you, I, not that <clears throat> I don't want to go into religious part of my life. Um, I want people to really sit down and listen to me. All right. I'm in the mood of telling people <laughs> one or two, three things about myself. Uh, uh, from the womb, okay. I spent three good years. Three good years. Two months. Three years, two months. Were you told by your mom or I by was, your dad? I was told by everybody. And the church, if you don't believe me, the church is still there. Tabo, tabo, agege, kerubun, and seraph. Tabo, tabo, agege, kerubun, and seraph. You say, you say. And that is why you always, there's no record of mine that we, you will not see the reflection of Kerubon and Seraphon's songs. So actually, you started singing right from Kerubon and Seraphon. 
lo ke de ayo no fun gogo aye bo mo lorun segun yiku si ti yin ti yin pe la yo royin no ko da gun to to gun wa o ba mi de a segun bi de ogo ola si let me let me let me tell the world the secret behind my success the secret behind my success careful and sure. you are about our old at that time i've been <laughs> i've been leading the choir a group in our church since age of seven age seven at that time your mom happens to be a choir member and your dad the head, the head of the choir and you took no my father no no, no. your father don't know no, no, no. no my father is purely my ballad camera as well he has his own cathedral no. singing in church being a part of a choir in church is quite different from doing music professionally you see <clears throat> So at what age do you make your mind up? You know what? Yes. I am going to face music squad. <laughs> you see, uh, my career okay. is like, honestly, I love my people. I love the Shinomaniacs all over the world. To the core. I'm one artist that I don't like. I always like them to know the truth. If there's anything behind my success, number one, maybe because of my religion background. You know, Kiriba and everything is like. Everything is like you are waking our Almighty God every second. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Hear our prayer, hear our prayer, hear our. That is much asking less, but much giving let's do it this way <laughs> in nigeria bugu awon obi won ni gbagbo pe ogodo koko kawe but in your own scenario our school will let look at to face only no 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 <clears throat> going to education to me is the key okay but because of one thing or the other or the other uh, now i would like my audience to listen to this okay as the first born of a family okay seeing my siblings siblings seeing my parents in one room apartment i will that anytime during the holiday from ijoko water to be precise i know ijoko very well good coming to meet my parents in Oshuti. okay a visit to my mother my father arguing with themselves because of money me sleeping on the floor and by one one thirty two they'll be struggling with themselves one thirty load will be one thirty load also. okay boy you know it's your <laughs> for you to see your baba and your mama but then they argue struggling and you did downstairs you did listen you did listen but the thing say you don't sleep. what did they cause the argument ask your parents they have passed away. <laughs> <laughs> so then I said to myself, education 
is very, very important. Important, definitely. But when you don't have option than to give give yourself to sacrifice yourself to the family. To the family. I don't have choice. And I'm happy that <laughs> when you're making that decision to sacrifice yourself for the family, it will be Omar Dumelo. Omar Omar but let me be honest with you, the the thing is I cannot even honestly whatever Shinopita is today is mystery. Maybe God just want God just me. You see, my father and my mama, eh? <laughs> my papa and my mama they suffer. Don't forget the adage. Because you know, we are first to I don't want to go to that. I from nowhere to become somebody. Apart from that, with I can almost ten years old. Ofi obiati, ofi babati yale. By now, we are going to pani. Simba, je eni ton ten, we ni moto amugbo on all these things. But if God can use you to turn the situation of the family around. The situation around. People should not blame me for my education background. We are not. No one should. Besides, it's your option. Remember, you do what you love to do. Remember, uh, grammatical error. <laughs> <laughs> and a fella told me that. Oh, that's bad. A fella told me that you know you'll be a year boy now. Say you tell them, say you go university, or you tell them, say you'll be Cambridge. You why? Why must you be panicked? Be no. So, Lord, my dumb wife, mom, me, at the daddy, one of you, she left me. Kelo face is here. No, they refused to. Okay. But the thing be say, they two did not say this guy. Prophecies before he was born. How can a child, no my child, be in the womb for three, three years, months, three no, years, three years, two months, two months in the womb, in the womb. So, and everything about me has been prophesied. Prophesized. She right. understand. So, there are something that I always appreciate. A, is my creator. I asked God. my creator, my God, my almighty God, that <laughs> why me? Every time, why me? At age of 10, I can look the spirit in me is with the spirit in me supersedes everything that God has if there is anything that I appreciate God for God used me for less privilege God used me for 
sent my son to unite the country. God used me for use your music to unite the country called Nigeria as a whole. Because from my end, remember, before Jibu or Awusa will say, I beg for what that Ngba Ngba music, I don't want to listen. It's a save you are reading in my mind. Because I was going to ask you my next question. <laughs> Almost everyone knows that you are more or less a mentee to the late Prince Adekunle. Omoni ye, omoni de. Omola se, ni bubadale. And, <laughs> show you believe that, that prophecy. Because I was going to ask you, we know you were with Evangelist Ebene Saobi mm -hmm. for a while. So tell us a bit about. Let's start with the evangelist, Ebenezer Obi. Okay. One. Look, Pierre, let me tell you. When I left my parents, how did you get to evangelist, Ebenezer Obi? There are some things. Okay. People are watching us. Definitely. And people are still going to read my book. Definitely. More documentaries. They are, we haven't seen, seen anything, anything or seen anything okay. yet. There are lots, lots in me. I can see. That I can, I cannot explain. If I left my parents at 2 a.m. midnight, that's why today, if I'm home, if I'm at home, you will always see me with boxer short. I love boxer short a lot. And I love them because, look, Parents, I'm done with education. The way I'm seeing you people, you won't be able to maintain myself and my siblings. So let me go out there and do something. Okay, we're going to enjoy a bit of an advert now. My people in London, please join me. Break my 68th birthday and 50 years on stage. Get ready, get ready, get ready. This summer, Shinomania live in London. Afro Juju legend, Sir Shinna Peters, live at the world famous Indigo O2 London. Sunday, the 1st of July. For tickets and info, cocobar.com and axs.com. 0208 953 1219. 07 495 349 431. Date July 1st. Shinomania. Come witness Sir Shinna Peters, the icon, live. Powered by One Music, One Sound, CocoBar.com and Phoenix Media. Supported by DJA Media, Drew, OEPR and Your Fresh TV. Now, welcome back from that short break. You were explaining that at age 10, if it is where we are now, they will tell you you are still underage. You don't know your right from your left. So your parents actually allowed you at age 10. Okay, carry on. They didn't allow me. Okay. In fact, I don't want to go into the detail. Just summarize yeah. it. Because we don't have I, enough I, I, time. I, I, I know there's I, so much in you to no, let, let me, let me, let me, let me. You say you, eh, you are too inclusive. <laughs> in, Papa and Mama want their better life. Their, their, their child to go to, to school. school and already... They don't pack the uh, mattress, the uh, pill, you know. Then, when you are going to a boarding house, pillow, mattress, everything. Buckets. No, and from nowhere I woke up and I said to them, that, look, I'm not going tomorrow. I'm not going to school tomorrow. Even by, as I was speaking to you that mom, I'm leaving now. now. Where are you going? I cannot say. That thing just says, leave. Go out there. Just leave. Go out there. It's out there. 
that your subject is. And you followed that thing still? I followed. That's why it's good. Here we are here today are. enjoying that's that. The, that's the tank of the concert coming on, on, on Sunday. Sunday. Here we are. So let's leave that aside. <laughs> your relationship with Evangelist Ebenezer Obi, tell us a bit about it. The beginning of it to the right. <laughs> and look, uh, 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 something led to that. Okay, give us. Okay, uh, you know, from home to a unknown, unknown, unknown destination. After, uh, okay, uh, let me search for a business of business. Okay, back by Jao, you. Commander was li living the, uh, at Baba Jao there. And I went there. And I, the, the, the security asked me that. They, they called them vigilante there. Yeah. Uh, uh, sorry, they called them vigilante. And three days after, before I can see Chief Commander Bin's office. And I just was prostrate. Oh, and Daddy, please, please, Ofer Lulu. I want to play music. Ofer Lulu. I said, sure. I think it's 10. Uh, where's your parents? I said, forget about that. Child. I want I just want to be like you. And he said, I'm about to go, go out. Come back. And he asked security that till I die. Because commander allowed me that the security should let me in and wait for him. When he finally came back, how old are you? I told him, where's your parents? I said, okay, what can I do for you? <laughs> Dad, please. As you are now, me too, I want to. You won't be like you. I want to be like you. What year was unknowingly, that? You unknowingly that. I can handle instrument because in our church I've been playing. Now they call it keyboard, but we call Duru. it organ. Duru. There, and there's no way you can know how to play duro. Definitely, they can play duro, organ, all the seven chaps. You want to know them? Yes, that is how. To commander back to Saja Deva. He, he has this red guitar in city room. I started no practice there. Yes. No practice there. Eh? Okay, he, he tuned the score. You see, my, you see, people no, should not see me as, people should see me as someone that a special ratio of, of God that doesn't know what has to stock for. So you taught yourself how to play the organ? Yes. And you taught yourself how to play the guitar? And sax. You taught yourself how to play the saxophones? Yes. Or in fact, I'm a concert master. To him be the glory. So, carry on with the story with. So, so, so you see, and, no, 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 there's no way you are still on that age, I can take you. But if you can bring your parents, parents. And at least no more share, yes. he will bring his parents to so, sign. So then he asked me to go and bring my father. Okay. And don't forget that, don't forget that I told you that <laughs> Ija, between me and my parents, is like this is only dog door <laughs> that we want. My father is ready to spend all his pension money. 
eh, for me to be a doctor, accountant, lawyer, whatever. For, so for me now to say, okay, I want, want to, to go into music. No. So for me now to go back to my plan, ask him to follow me to everything that will be his house. But you, what long she might she share? I went back and I told my father, if you truly my, that's why I, my father, up to today, up to today, you know, some will say I love my mother most, me, eh, not my papa, because my mother, I say, I don't want to share my love with anybody, so I don't want you to share. Are they still alive? They are no more. Okay. My father didn't share his love with his only Shinobuya. Because my mother, she's Omoya now, I can see that, well, the way Dofi love me, not Dofi love Benga Peters, not Dofi love Yomi Peters. So you understand all, all of But my father, no. So, your dad went with you to meet Evangelist Ebenezer Obe? You are right. And Commander asked him, him that, are you truly the father of him? And my father said, yes. Okay, thank you, sir. This is the address. Go to the address, meet my lawyer, sign the uh, contract, contract for him. He said that I will set him up. So how long were you with Evangelist <laughs> Let me tell you, Commander refused to allow me to be part of his band. Instead of that, it's either I mean I go back to school or he set me up on something different apart oh, from no, music. No, no, no. Music. He, Commander was ready to equip, equip me because I had the privilege of listening to his speech on your 60th birthday. And the one that was celebrated in yes. Nigeria. He made a statement. He said, when I met Shino, I saw a future star in Shino. A new real. A I, new I real. had it. Yes. Yeah. Because I watched it. <laughs> so, you see all this. So, with that, that's why I don't push this type of, you know, when this is the area of very very spiritual about my life i don't discuss it i don't even want to remember but the only thing if god is with you nobody, nobody can, can be against you so in total if we were to count one two three how many years did you spend with evangelist <sighs> truly you know man now <laughs> <laughs> me, eh? me, I'm the young slab. I always remember back home that she know. Remember back home, Mama, Papa, my and Papa, big Papa, and my younger ones. Younger ones. That's why in the first place you leave home. So don't lose focus. So. And Commander left me with his uh, with his band to the another part of the country. And before he came back, thanks to God. Uh, I had a, a, an opportunity, opportunity to join Prince Adekunle Band when Prince Adekunle had an accident. Okay. But that time you were known for the guitar. Yes. So was it actually the guitar? Can you play guitar as you did, do your hand. Like, <laughs> you see? I know my talent. <laughs> <laughs> your talent is talking. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> talk more, talk more, talk more, talk more. Big day, yeah. yeah. They're not the year of now. <laughs> this is like sitting next to me, life and direct. The one and the only Afro Juju creator. You know, when you found out. It's good to have you next to me. So, Prince Adekule, another journey. Mm, starts. So, give us a clue about that as well. He said he the, the, the had an accident. Okay. And we are about eight that okay. they invited for uh, audition. Audition, okay. Audition uh, after. Okay. He said, 
you join sorry to cut you short you join evangelist Ebenezer Obey at about age 10. yeah so how old are you when you were joining prince adil Kunle? like six months after being sorry six months after so you are not yet 11 when you were joining prince yes. adil Kunle. okay so at that age 11 we went you were very good on guitar don't forget when I, when prince adil Kunle got an accident okay and the 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 bank the management the label owner called uh, mr molakasi and the owner of uh, the commission here called okay finally decided to take prince adequate to it's right london okay i i still remember the place uh, 16 salting road sw2 brixton <coughs> So you were part of the crew that came that time. Yes. What year was that? Ten. What year? Ten. And uh, 1970. No, 1912. You were age 12 that age time. Age 12. That's a very crucial because people thought I was chief commander Ebenezer Obey. Because they always say Baba Olu Baba Olu Ashino. And from there again, join Prince Adekunle and young Shino Omoni, young Shino in Leo Madekunle, London, Timo, why you, Madele? Mutu Wakala Omo, London, Tipe. But now, Luma, Madele, like you. I love London, honestly. Are you are in London? I'm now. in London. Because you are not in London, I'm part of them. You are even looking like Omo London. Of course. To my sobe. I want to have your Madekunle. <laughs> so, how long were you with Prince Adil Kunle for? Oh, 70, we were in London together, 72, 74, 76. About three, four years? We are, we are. So, at what time do you have that conviction? No, 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 don't jump, Adekunle. don't jump. Okay. I'm not jumping. We we don't have so much time. We're trying well, to well, compress well, as much see, as we can. The, my first, my second London seventy two. Okay. This organization called UNICO, United Nigeria Cultural Organization. Okay. Gave me the title of that sir. Okay. In 1972. Yeah. It's like in the return to guitar. Hmm. <laughs> so you still play the guitar Saint very Pacras, well now. To be precise, Saint Pancras. So you still play the guitar very well. Try me on Sunday. All of you, try me on Sunday. Join us on, Sunday. on Sunday. Come Sunday. and watch this legend. Try me on Sunday. Do is playing on Sunday. Uh, anyway. Sunday, Indigo uh, uh, O2. Oh, oh. Arena. <laughs> oh, Join Arena. us on Sunday from 7 p.m. You are part of them. He is a living legend. Come and see him. Display his talent. I can see his fingers. He cannot wait to display oh, his talent. Hey, man, it's on tag guitar. So it is because uh, of the guitar they gave way. you that <laughs> name. <laughs> yes, sir. Sir, she not be there. So how old were you when they confirmed you with 12. that title? Twelve. So you became a sir at age twelve. Twelve. Okay. Carry on. So I've been. <laughs> this is a big. This is going to be a big surprise to my odd lovers. I had my first job at age of 14. Age of 14. I bought my first car at 13, built my first house at 16. And you spent three years, two months in your mom's womb. You're right. <laughs> and you were 60, you are still looking as if you are 32. Did you say so. <laughs> because I can say so. You know one of the things he does? Whenever he gets on the stage, it took off, it takes off his shirt, flings it away, and it be... How do you do that? No, 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 no. You know, you, you know what? Now, that is what we're asking our upcoming artists to do. Don't go into the industry, music industry, because of the fame, not the money aspect. You must have passion for whatever you are going into. So, because if you don't have passion, you don't have love. You get bored and tired of it. Yes. Especially when the other side. So, at what point, the separation between and Prince Adekunle, at what point did it happen? 
76. 76. So after, after, after the London trip. Okay. So, so why was it after the London trip? Why was it not before the London trip? Japanese <laughs> over the deal. Okay then. <laughs> I understand. For those of you that don't understand that <laughs> proverb. Proverb. <laughs> so now, at a particular time, time. But you say I'm so happy. That at the end. You fulfilled. I, fu I, 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 I have all the obligations. So now, when when my great boss died, hmm. solely, solely. I buried him. Prince Adekunle. Yes. That's very good. With, with his sons, daughters, the family. I was the only product that Juju Music can produce to bury Prince Adekunle. Because I was going to ask you, at that time you were following him around. Does he have any child of your age range? Ah, no. No. Okay. okay. After Prince Adekunle, another veteran juju musician that you are known with, Sir Shino Adewale, back in the days. Shegun Adewale. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this. Inoki uh, Baro. Tell us a bit. So no, 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 no. You see, the God to call is on the way. When President De Kunle asked the, the, his former musicians, his band boys, his band boys left him. Sure. So we tried to regroup. So we regrouped ourselves, call it. Prince Adekunle and his supersonic sound. That is how we started with. So you are part of the people that produced that album. Yeah, we started. So you are the lead guitarist yeah. in that. Then, album. then we, we, we. Lee came to join the band. The band. So you were there before. So. Him. I, yeah, of course, of course now, of course now. Even I was the captain, but I left the captainship for him. You know, because you know why? All my life is Fela Anikulakpa. All my life. Me, I don't know Fela Anikulakpa as Fela Anikulakpa. They are no Fela Rasom Kuti. Before, let me tell you, any time, any day, Whatever you think about Fela, to me, Fela is my idol. I will see it anywhere, anywhere. That is why my own juju is, his own music is Afro, Afro. mine is Afro, Afro juju. We are coming there. So now, <laughs> at the beginning, Evangelist Ebene Saobe, you moved to Prince Adekunle. You know what, where you are going? My father complained that, when are you going to bear my name? <laughs> So I, <laughs> now I believe you go to Kerubo Yeah. From Prince Adekule, you moved to Shino Obe. Shino Adekule. Shino Adewale. Now, Shino that decision to be Shino Peter, when did it happen? Shino, oh, 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 you know, I was touched with my father's expression at that time. That you've never done it. my name. It's only money. And you are taking care of us. But not the name to be known. Not you know, then immediately that thing sank into me. Wait, wait. Tony Baba is so. We told him if we pull out, I just can't do it. Go away, me. Move it, do it. Go to you, be so. And you're not on target, sir. To be so bad. Anyway, don't show up. So everybody, both old and young, 
<laughs> will remember. They are always remembered. Afro Juju, Shino, Peter, Sigbati, Walode, was that your first album? No. How many albums have you produced or have you released prior to that? Way to Freedom. Okay. That freedom means... What year was that Way to Freedom? Way to Freedom, 1980. 1980. Because I was having problems with uh, my label owner because they said I, I, I signed a contract of 10 years and between me and, uh, and my, my partner, Shegun Wadewale, I can see that I, I want to do something in me that I'm not, I'm not ex what we are, we are under somebody's shadow like playing like obey today, playing like Sony tomorrow. I want to do something. You want to have your own yeah, unique style. I want to style. have my own, you know, identification. And Way to Freedom 1980. Freedom 1981. Okay. Way to Freedom 1980. Freedom. freedom. Hmm. Way to Freedom. The way now, to here, the, way, here the, is the, the way, Freedom. The, the Way to Freedom. The, the Way to Freedom is. Move a Joru Koti, you be so me. She no pitas, she no pitas. Then, freedom. freedom is. We shan't walk in the darkness in this world because we are very proud in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the only name. So after I that, was praying that God just. God, my just hear my prayer and let me. Well, people refuse to listen to me. Uh, you remember the fracas between the tenant and the landlord then? The, uh, the tenant and the landlord, they are so. Okay. Oroni Lake Belu, Aya Lake Bay, Oti Sumi. Nobody listen. Nobody. Then I went back to the studio. Shall we let our blessing? A Wuti Mowo from Fumba Lau, Shall we let Mm. And I said to myself, you know, and so. But I will not mention names. Names. He just told me, "Lord, we can't even talk about it." We need Baba. We need to play. He too was playing. And money reaction and we I was going to ask you at the beginning. You joined the Bini Saobi to really because you made you made the statement that the Baba Mufi money target. Prince Ade Kunle guitar. Yeah. Shegun Ade Wale guitar. Me only Kori. Shubato Ba Wo. I was the first to use triple neck of guitar in Nigeria. Followed by Victor Wyvo. You know, so Shuri, all these things, by you saying it yourself, who might have been your friend? Morally. Morally. So I, I don't discuss my success, but I discuss the people that made me. Hmm. That is why I'm in London. London is supposed to be my home because they appreciate. They, they say, look, let me tell you, as an artist, at that age that you've been, been you, you've been going to a place, shower with loves everywhere and there, and you are now sixty. How dare me to celebrate sixty? Without telling my people what you've been through, how it all started. No, sharing my celebration with the people the London that people. they started. It. I'm saying this: if my audience in Nigeria, they should pardon me by saying this: that I started my career with my London people, and by sixty. 50 years on stage, How they, they are, even Nigeria, in Nigeria, they are still celebrating me. And I said to them that without me going to London and say to my 
people in no, London. No, thank you. This is the payback time to tell them that how much I love them. Payback time to tell them I cherish them a lot. They are part of the success, my success. You know, so that is why this trip, ah, it is like not until Sunday after Sunday, maybe, but the only thing I'm asking God for, my London people, you are watching and you are listening to me. As you are celebrating me at 60, 50 years on stage, may the God Almighty give me the grace, grant me the grace to celebrate all of you, your 60. Let's start from your 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 1. After all, your name is Jusela. I love you. That will bring me back to you. Only sorrow. So, you. at that point, it was a little showers of blessings. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, what now happened? People refused to listen to Yes. They were given the fees. They were for four good years. But that day, that particular day that I watched what happened between my brother, because he always called me Shine Shine, Shine a Boy. Oh, honestly, I'm missing him already. I'm missing him. I've been, I've been thinking how I wish he was still alive. To celebrate with me, Chief Skin and Empire, the creator of Fuji music, by his own right, you know. And I, I, I would like, I would like to quickly. I want to insert something okay. to correct impressions. My twin brothers was see in the. Don't miss, I don't, I, you don't misquote him all. People misquoted him. He doesn't say he's, he's the one that created Fuji. He built Fuji to what Fuji is today. today. So after watching the late Sikura in the barista, what happened next? Then I said to myself that Juju is killed. Okay, so what are you going to do? You are a YouTube musician, and if your pride of music is dead, you uh, as well. <laughs> <laughs> then I said to myself, okay, I want to listen to what they are dancing to. to in that Fuji. I went to Barista's shoes twice. Then I said to myself, it's not the, 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 uh, the, the lyrics. lyrics or the reading. It's Enyonilu me or the Wello. King, 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 yeah. Omele. Yes, yeah, Omele. That is why in, in Afro Juju, and you know, Mele, you're by me, tell you what. And you know, Mele, dear, dear. You know, Mele, dear, dear. So they are going out of fire. I want to kill, I want to kill, I want to kill. Two birds. Many birds with a stone. <laughs> with a, just with a stone. Then I went, to, because I, I have passion for what I'm doing. My my experiment is to use my music to cut across, to unite the, the, the country together. I hate Igbo, Awusa, Yoruba, Beg. Let us be one. Then I went to fella, and then I said, look, you know, eh, hey, make I tell you with that your coconut head. Everybody can sing. So far, you can find or you can locate where you belong. You to. belong. Play music that suits your voice. That is why. Oh, we do so quick. Oh, we just see. I do care. That's why. Any time, any day, I give you the fire. So what? He taught me how to use my to look for. I'm a, I'm an instrumentalist. He knew. That I can do it. I can find the, 
the music that suits my voice. That's number one. Then he said, let your lyrics 50% of Yoruba and 50% of English. So when you go to Port Harcourt or Bini or Ilausa, you'll be able to carry your audience along. No. And that is right now. We yeah, are Beguna, that's so Beguna, that's how much you find you. Sequel, sequel, if you go eat, God, Robo, I yare, I love you. So, listening to the late Afro Juju, late Afro curator, mm -hmm. fella Nicola Kokuti, and watching the late Ainde Barista Sekiro live on stage propelled you to produce okay. Afro Juju. Chief Commander Ms. Obe, okay, I told you, okay. Ijoshino. Commander, you remember that track? I'm black, I'm proud. I'm black, I'm proud. I'm black, I'm proud. I'm black, I'm proud. Ijoshino. Ereshino. Afro Juju. Afro Juju. Only only. You know what happened? I remember most of these things. Before the emergence of all this referred to as DJ. We used to call them Bugwelere in Nigeria. Yeah. I'm not sure if you remember. But yes, now. They were called Bugwelere. So we, have, we had one on the street I was living then. So any new album. So I can actually sing them from here to said at that time. So as soon as he puts that Afro Jew, you should not be tasting. But everybody will run out. <laughs> I will see that on Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> so now, after Afro Juju, the fame came. Mm. The money, if I'm not mistaken. No. <laughs> Don't go there. Don't go there. The fame came. The fame. What you wanted was achieved at that time. The first one was Afro Juju Series 1, if I'm not mistaken. No, Afro Juju is. Is. Then Shinomania. Shinomania. But let me tell you, Shinomania sold and then is. At that time, when you released Afro Juju, they were. Uh, great juju musicians ahead of you but it's as if you captured everybody you see it, that that credit it's as if you, you can one I, I will accept the credit i believe that the almighty that we have just used me to relieve some people that they are born bondage at that time. At that time. Because the two giant artists, <laughs> they've been there 35 years, refused to. No one can challenge them. Then I said to myself that why, I'm sure the reason why is because then you must be able to play guitar and at the same time be singing. And that is the guitar that is putting the poor <laughs> if i might ask you to post there yeah. i had someone there's this very popular promoter in the city of london called gaji of london mm. i had you are the one that turned him into a promoter to what extent is that true <clears throat> if gaji is what's the name of this guy uh, in america uh king the the, the, the uh, boxing promoter King uh, that promoted people like Muhammad Ali. Okay. Tyson, at that time. Yes. Uh, because King. Somebody, I can't really remember. I can't really remember. If there is somebody today in this entertainment, <laughs> he started over to me. Gaji is. The typical Omoyaunubu, Omobabaolubu of Nigeria. Really? Night crawler to, to I mean. Up till now, he's still a night crawler. So, and his mother with my mother, they are very close. Yeah, no, they are related. They are blood. They are blood. Because what really prompted me to ask this question? Some people were arguing no, when no, you no. say you are celebrating 50 years on stage. Yes. It, it is true. It is not true. It is true. It is not true. And they came into the scene. Yes. You see, Gaji, because of his passion for music, I quickly utilized the opportunity. 
to take him along. That's to right. take him along. So I don't call him God Joe. I, I call him a Momo Gaji. Very down to earth person. It's I can confirm that. It, it, I mean, nothing to add when it comes to Gaji. You know, though we have our own different side and bad side, but yet, Gaji is humble. You know, that's how long were you together for? How? Oh, God. Do let's go there. Me and Gaji, we've committed so much. Because a lot of good things, though. A lot of people will be hearing this for the very first time. I'm a lot of people I'm know I'm him I'm with I'm the Fuji. Yeah. No, 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 no. He started with me. When he started with you, was he your manager? Yes. What was it to you? So how, how he, 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 he was the one that used to be my manager. So how long did he manage you for? Ah! Years. Before he finally left to manage Sikra in the Barista, before he left, uh, he now, the, later he left Sikra in the Barista to my twin brother, Wasiwa in the Barista. I know so many of you are enjoying this particular program, but there's one thing I have realized with SSP. It has so many things to say. <laughs> but like the Yoruba always say it, oh, when your car general quelenu, on fa. It has so many Yoruba more. Oh, when your car general quelenu, on fa, no news. On fa, no abu on fa ofu. Okay, whatever you call it. You go go le, go Yoruba, go carry more car and go ni. On fa, no ni. Ofu, ofu is truth. On fa, no. And you love me so. Eh, ma abu. Eh, ma do boy si. Ma do. If I allow them, it will keep talking and talking and talking. Because I love, yeah, my, people. Mo, I love my people in London. Su, wo, ko, kire, wo. They can stand there and sing and sing. And it's not just a singer. He plays the guitar. Are you going to play the keyboard for us on Sunday? Or is I'm only playing guitar? my going... guitar. I'm playing my keyboard. Customized guitar. All the way from Nigeria. Or oh, you are buying a brand new here? <laughs> <laughs> Look, my first guitar ever. You were joking. I'm telling you. You kept it? Yes. Is it going to go on auction? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> SSP, the My younger brother. generation, the upcoming ones, every single time they talk, they mention your name. Sashino Peter paved the way for we us. Thank God. So, the very last word for them as we are rounding up now. <sighs> and what should people be expecting on Sunday? Upcoming ones. Yes. In as much you can, I've been saying so much about myself. Okay. I've said so much. I think you can pick one or two things. Definitely. Humility is the key. Hmm. Be humble. Be respectful. Forget the money for now. Forget the thing for now. Those are material things. They will come later. But let people place you. Don't place yourself. So what should we be expecting on Sunday? Yes, Sunday. Wow, 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 wow. Honestly. <laughs> if anybody missed the Sunday, Sunday. show, because I won't repeat my sixth. It is only once in a lifetime. Yes. yes. And I, I, honestly, for you to tell you how much I love you, for me to pay back, for me to show that I appreciate you, I will do everything that after that show, you will have caused to be grateful to God on my behalf because I'm going to celebrate you too, like I said before. So on Sunday, join us, Indigo O2, or O2 Indigo, Indigo. <laughs> Why we we'll celebrate the Afro Juju creator, Afro Juju founder, Sir Shino Peter. From myself, Beke Lulua.
and SSP. We're saying bye bye for now. See you Sunday evening. Bless you. Bye. My people in London, please join me to celebrate my 68th birthday and 50 years on stage. Get ready, get ready, get ready. This summer, Shinomania live in London. Afro Juju legend, Sir Shinna Peters, live at the world famous Indigo O2 London, Sunday the 1st of July. For tickets and info, cocobar.com and axs.com. 0208 953 1219. 07 495 349 431. Date July 1st. Shinomania. Come witness Sir Shinna Peters, the icon, live. Powered by One Music, One Sound, CocoBar.com and Phoenix Media. Supported by DJA Media, Drew, OEPR and Your Fresh TV.